Good day guys and welcome to the vlog. Sunday was a day off of vlogging, uh, but I still want to give you guys a vlog, so I thought I'd go through the last vlog and go through some of the comments and respond to some of the comments. Uh, that way you guys get a vlog. Some people hate when I don't vlog, so uh, this, we're going to be doing this every once in a while because it's just a good uh, a day off for me for doing that. Uh, so Madeira, let's start with Madeira and time to enjoy another Ken Tomic vlog. Thank you, Madeira. Sean Mallory said 10 videos away from 1000. I'm excited and another Ken morning to enjoy. And Glenna said, good Sunday morning. Well, good morning to you too. Justin said, love the start to the video coffee. Uh, Ken, your videos sure rock as you say. Keep up the videos, we love them. Well, thank you. Jet Picard said, nice video, Ken. I love the behind the scenes vlogs. Have a great afternoon. You too, sir. Michael informed me that he works for Max, I believe, and he says they're not being bought up by 7-Eleven, but it will change to Circle K. Again, if they take away the eggnog, I'll be devastated. Critical Each Japan said, good to see you in a good mood. Thanks, buddy. And good to see your comment section getting a nice scrub job too. Good vlog, now good night, Z's. Justin said, good vlog, and he really wants to get some shots of Megan's car in the driveway. I'll see what I can do. Little Star said, good vlog as usual. Try not to put sugar in your coffee and use zero calorie artificial sweeteners. Well, I'm using Stevia, so it's not an artificial uh, sweetener, uh, but sometimes I use sugar once in a while just for the extra kick. Ben Fitzgerald said, lucky Canadian drinkers in Ireland, we get no monetary reward for recycling bottles, cans at all. Lovely 27, or sorry, lovely 17 Celsius March day here. Blue skies, strong sunshine, plus a vlog, plus a Ken vlog, nice. Lisa B liked my line where I said, it's not the alcohol, it's the deposit. Funny! A lot of people like Jenny would like to be moderators. Right now I'm just keeping it to a small number to see how it works. Uh, I also did get a comment from somebody saying, you know, there are people like uh, Casey Neistat who, you know, when he stopped vlogging and went to CNN, uh, the hate that he got was supposedly uh, ridiculous, but he doesn't delete his comments. But uh, I don't know. I don't think he gets the same kind of hate as I do. I don't know. Uh, maybe he does. Maybe I am too sensitive for this stuff. I don't know. I've been doing it for 10 years. Uh, you know, um was let's compare that to PewDiePie, the, the biggest YouTuber in the world. He got sick of it too and actually shut his off and then turned it back on, but again, got moderators. And it's to, it's to clean up the, this, the dumb stuff. Again, I don't want to stop the regular constructive criticism comments. I only want to instruct to get rid of this, the absolute hate. Does that make sense? And I think we should just remove it as opposed to banning them. What do you guys think? Calico Cat 101 uh, do you, said, do you drink tea? I like Red Rose in the afternoon. Uh, if I drink tea, it's once in a while, but it's always Earl Grey. Amy said, since Carol's getting more comfortable in front of the camera, she should do more cooking videos. We'll see what we can do. David Summers put a link uh, to the, the spinner, the fidget spinner thing. Thank you for that. Again, the guy who sent it to me never sent me any links to what he wanted me to specifically have a link to. So, and I sent him an email, he hasn't responded. Muhammad Mike said, hey Ken, hope you're enjoying the weekend. Boy, what a difference it makes to this channel having mods in here now. I agree. Bob asks, how do you know if you're a moderator? Uh, you will get an email from YouTube saying that Ken's chosen you as a moderator and give you some of the, the guidelines. Beatrice says, uh, love your vlogs. I look forward to watching them every day. Well, thank you very much. I love making them for you guys every day. Joanne was worried about the, the beer box eye view uh, when I was camera. She thought I was going to drop it all. I was too. I thought I was going to drop something, especially the camera. Matthew, Matthew Wilson said, nice video, Ken's colon. Hirashi said, I used to make coffee at home. Now I prefer buying, a f buying it fresh from my local coffee place. Yeah, but that can get expensive. Add that up over the course of a year. See how much that costs you. Moonlighter6 said, America needs to follow Canada's lead and take the empty bottles back. Too many end up shattered in parking lots. 
and on the side of the road. I agree. Lupin said, whoa, Phantom Carol sighting at the end of the video. Soup's on. I love how observant you guys are. Eric said, you and Paul should make an incredible Hulk for the cook and review. I agree. I like that idea. Ace said, Ken, you should check out the Halliburton Forest Wolf Reserve. It's very cool. I've been wanting to do stuff like that for a while. Uh, I think I have two more tomorrow and Wednesday. So Tuesday, Wednesday, I have Carl in. And I think that's the last I'll be working with Carl for a while uh, because he has to go out and start shooting more shows. Uh, and then my editing will be all freed up and my days will be freed up to go and do really cool things like that. There's also a uh, bird sanctuary, you know, uh, a falconry. So guys who have falcons uh, is close by my house. So uh, we'll be doing more stuff like that in the vlogs. And that's all the time we have for today, guys. Let me know in the comments below if you love when I go through the comments and respond to you guys like this. Uh, it's definitely easier to do this once in a while than it is for me to go every day and respond to you guys' comments every single day. So let me know in the comments below. Love you guys. Thanks for sticking around uh, with all my channels and all your help. Thanks to my moderators. Thanks to one more thing. How do you read the description? I almost forgot, guys. I wanted to thank all my super chat people who came out on, I guess it was Saturday night. So during Saturday, I did a live show using my iPhone, uh, and uh, that worked out really well. So I thought I'd try it with the OBS. Somebody said it's really easy to use OBS. So I tried it, and it worked out really good. And we had like, I don't know, up to 105 people on that, only on my vlog channel, and it was really cool. I had a couple moderators in there cleaning up the spammers. Uh, people that will just type the same thing over and over, like e, 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 all the way through. It's just like, it's pushing all your guys' comments, your good comments, out of there. And if you don't have moderators to help you get rid of that stuff, then uh, I appreciate my moderators is what I'm saying. Thank you very much. Uh, and i also like to thank the uh, people that did the super chat. Uh, so it is uh, Nori Griff, and Russell W, uh, Gareth, Lord um, Maloon and Sherario Raw, Ken Van Tassel, and Webcam Troll videos. All those guys, thank you very much for coming on to the live show, supporting me financially to do that. If that happens all the time, uh, I asked you guys in, during the show, and people left comments saying, uh, and also emailed me, which was great, thank you. Uh, how many live shows they would like to actually see a week. And and people were also saying, don't try to only keep your live shows to the vlog channel because there'll be less people. Ninja's right here. He wants to say hi. Hi, Ninja. Ninja. Oh, you got the butt view. Sorry about that. Um, so how many live shows you'd like to see a week? What would you like to see on the live show? Most people just want to say hi and, and talk to you. Uh, that's what I, that's what it seems like most people want to do. Some people have legitimate questions um, uh, that like they they want to ask something about my past or the present or the future, uh, which is great too. Uh, that's what we're there for. But I wouldn't mind turning it into a show and do like either an hour to two hour shows three times a week. That would be great. And I wouldn't mind trying it on the big channel just to see what happens. It would probably go crazy. If I do it on the big channel, I have to eat something or do a challenge. Because uh, that's what people go to that, cha that channel for, is to see me eat, to see me do challenges. Uh, so that's what that has to be on the big channel. But the vlog channel, we can do anything we want. Because uh, it's the vlog channel. I'm also thinking about doing a live vlog. Literally do like a... If, if I was going to do something... Uh, in the morning or in the, in the afternoon or in the evening literally do a live vlog a two hour a one to three hour i don't know what it would be vlog of what i'm doing throughout that time period it would be really really interesting uh or do uh like four segments so I'll do a morning uh noon dinner and then evening one one and a half hour vlog so it won't be a huge long huge long vlog but anyway there's a lot of information there for you guys. Again, leave a comment in the comment section below what you guys like and don't like about this kind of vlogging. Well, it's kind of more like Q&A. Let's call it a, a vlog Q&A. <laughs>